Hello there. Um, just taking the front off this Combi 185 um, so we can have a look inside. I've already taken the bottom panel off. Um, this is where the water tank is down here, all the electrics and uh, the pressure stat switch which is just under here and the pressure relief valve for the water tank. Once I've got these off we'll take the front cover off and you can see what's going on inside. I've got a dodgy ratchet here. Tedious. Not to worry. It's best to do this by hand rather than with something like an electric screwdriver because the, uh, the front cover is held in place on something called rivnuts which are compressed into the body of the machine and they're such a pain to replace if uh, someone cross threads um, one of these screws. So try and do it by hand if you can. I think we're nearly there, just the one left to unscrew. There we are. I'm going to put this out of the way. Let's leave it there for a minute. Okay, so filters at the top. This is a fresh air filter. This is the extract air filter. Just inside here, not sure if you can see, are the fans. They're EC motors, that is, they're infinitely variable. This is the heat exchanger. It's an interference fit, and I know what you're thinking. They were drunk when they fitted it. Well, no, actually, it's that way so that any condensate inside the heat exchanger will drain out onto the evaporator coil. That's this thing here. Here's your compressor. Behind that is condensing coil for the air, and the water condensing coil you can't see because it's around the bottom of the tank. It is outside the tank, not inside. That's quite important. This heat exchanger is an interference fit and very tight, will slide out as you can see. These fins are quite delicate, it's an aluminium body uh, with aluminium fins, they're very fine. The whole point is that they transfer the heat efficiently and quickly. So I'll just push that back in for now, it doesn't need cleaning because it's actually brand new. but. Fresh air comes in, passes this way through the heat exchanger and through into the duct at the back and that provides your fresh air. Extracted air from your wet rooms, bathroom, kitchen, etc. comes this way, is filtered so that the inside of the machine doesn't get dirty and it passes this way. The two air flows never meet, they're on opposite sides of very thin plates and the thing works without any moving parts, just the air flows driven by the fans. Simple, effective, very nice piece of kit. Thank you for watching.